Hi, my name is Luis Melendez and I am North Square Garden. These are the store here. This is my grandma house. Take a good picture of it. Look at the home hero. Believe it or not, I did this part right here. Just the part. I couldn't do anything. And what I'm holding in my hand is a pen that looks like a pencil. And what mm -hmm. you do is right here, you just take it apart and you can put it right back in. Take it apart, you can put it right back in. This garden was found early in like the 1980s. Mm -hmm. And the people that brought this garden together and this community to make this, they're called Grupo de Motivos. Mm -hmm. And the whole story started when this was just an empty lot, like it was so ugly and Together, people would, would dump their trash and people would do drugs and they, they didn't want this so they said stop, let's get together and make a community garden and this would just be can. Mm -hmm. This was made from Iris Brown, Tomasita, Iris, my, my grandma, and a bunch of other ladies. And these are many other people's plots. Yeah. And they had their names, I would tell you. Right here. And right here, these are fig trees. And these are figs. When they turn, like, purpley, I will eat them. And this is a Puerto Rico house. It is to remind people of Puerto Rico. This is the Puerto Rico house. This is all that we've made to make it more realistic as Puerto Rico. Right here will they be kitchen, where will they make coconut juice or, or coffee, grinds. And over here is where they used to sleep in. It's kind of creepy so you can go in. I'm not going in. So like if we have a fiesta or when the bomba groups come together to perform, they roast the pig. Yes. The hen and the rooster. I'm sorry you can't see eggs because they're old enough and they won't produce eggs anymore. But we still love them so we kept them. Right here is the place where the class used to be. And the reason that the plots are gone because of this. And right here, these little stones are what they wanted to put for what they used to make this garden. It was honesty, it was strength, it was joy. And that's what I have to say about Nourishment Garden.